Hi everyone. My name is Claire, and I'm John. And today we're talking about Lost at Sea. Probably one of my worst nightmares is oh, getting gosh. lost at sea.、Um, as you may remember, I'm terrified of the ocean. Even though I can swim really well, it makes no rational sense. But、uh, just the thought of this、oh, oh, makes me break out in a cold sweat.、Like、middle of the ocean, deep sea,、mm -hmm. nothing below you. Nothing. Oh gosh, terrible. <sighs> Maybe whales would、mm -hmm. be there as well.、Mm -hmm. I would be. I would be pushing. I, if I were Jack. I'd be pushing her off. I'd be like, nope, <laughs> this is、up. mine. Get me up. <laughs> anyway,、uh, yeah. if I may say, in the article, getting lost at sea could not have happened to two more deserving people. <laughs> can you say? You can say that. I think、uh, you can, can say、I、that. Can I say that? Well, I've said it now. Yeah.、So、there it is. <laughs> can you think of any famous missing persons cases in your country? Yeah, I was actually. I kind of went over this because I was. It was a bit curious about. What the internet would say about famous missing people, and there's like a few on the list, but the ones that immediately came to my mind were actually a criminal. I think I've talked about him before, DB Cooper.、Ah. He's still a missing person technically,、oh. and、uh, even though we know almost exactly what happened to this person, they are still technically missing. They were never found, nor was their plane. But Amelia Earhart. Ah,、oh, yes. And I figured that was more fitting for this story because more likely than not, it was over the ocean. Uh huh.、Mm -hmm. Yes.、Uh, if you don't know who this is, it was the first、uh, person, I believe, ever to try and travel around the whole world via plane. Ah.、Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Um, and she did not make it. <laughs>、mm -hmm. That's why she's missing. Um, but it was quite a good run. It was almost completed. Um, and. It was just very unfortunate there at the end. I believe, I think she was the pilot, and she had a, one co-pilot. There might have been two people: a navigator and a co-pilot. But yeah, they all went missing.、Oh. Very famous plane, very famous person. Everyone would know what she looks like,、mm -hmm. but not the co-pilot and the <laughs> navigator. No one knows what they look like. Oh yes, no one talks <laughs>、yeah. about them being no missing. No one talks about them being missing.、Um, the one I wanted to talk about. Mm -hmm. Was in the next question,、ah, but they're not missing,、oh. and I was so sad about it. They've been found. They, well, it is a long time ago. They all died,、uh. but they have been found. <laughs> yeah, but、uh, it was the Edmund Fitzgerald.、Mm -hmm. There's even a song written about it. A very good and fun song, very catchy song、uh, about tragedy. <laughs> so I guess I'll ask you, since they were all found, have you ever heard of someone who was met, went missing at sea? There was a very famous case when I was a teenager in the UK, and、um, he was. It was such a big deal because it was a famous.、Um, how to put it? You know,、um, Rockefeller in the United、ah, States. It was like yeah, the British yeah, Rockefeller、yeah. in the 1990s. He was a massive、um, media、yeah. mogul.、Mm -hmm. He was considered to be doing some dodgy dealings, but he was mega rich, and nobody could touch him. And then one day, he, he was out on his yacht,、mm -hmm. and then he just disappeared off the yacht. And the yacht came back. He didn't come back. Nobody knows what happened to him. But many people suspect that he was bumped off by perhaps、mm -hmm. some of his、uh, criminal associates. But anyway, we have no proof. He is still listed as missing. Oh, his name is Robert Maxwell. Okay. I should have said that. Yeah, yeah. At the end, we'll just edit that to the very name Rocket Ma Robert Maxwell, and then we'll go back to <laughs> who you probably think you've never heard of, but、uh -huh. he's the father of Ghislaine Maxwell. Oh, the one who went on trial along with Jeff Jeffrey Epstein. Oh gosh, that girl the, is his daughter. The They're all dodgy. That family, the Maxwell family. Well, Epstein. Well, anyways,、oh. he's not missing, but he was also probably bumped off. <laughs> yes, yes. yes. Maybe as they the say. It just brought to mind、uh, Born Identity when he's in, on the boat and he's supposed to be killing that politician dude,、mm -hmm. or I think it was politician. Anyways,、um, mm -hmm. but in any case, yeah, that's I'm sure going out to sea where there's less、uh, law <laughs> might have been a plan、mm -hmm. long in the running.、Mm -hmm. Yeah,、oh, interesting man. I really want to know all about this.、Some、crazy cases. <sighs> so okay. Um, you guys、uh, take a look at this totally bizarre but very interesting、mm. case of a missing two missing people,、mm -hmm. and then we'll come back and discuss it together. Lost at sea. Two young men from the U.S. got drawn into a web of conspiracy theories about the pandemic. They came to believe that vaccinations and testing were evil, and that the whole pandemic was a demonic hoax. Their guru, a YouTuber, 
convinced them to set sail for the South Pacific in order to escape the fall of civilization. But islands in the South Pacific also wanted the men to take COVID tests upon arrival. They reportedly decided it was better to jump overboard rather than comply, and they were never seen again.